It is used on Facebook more than 6,000 times a day. Good evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us tonight. Whether it's intentional or not, locals say the R word hurts. And hundreds of thousands locally and millions nationwide are trying to create awareness through a campaign called Spread the Word to End the Word. Valley News Team's Nicole Johnson shows us those trying to change our society. What is the I word? Makes me feel like a nobody. I, I am not nobody. I'm somebody. Well, I have two kids with Down syndrome, and uh, they are they're involved with their community and they, they enjoy life. And for them to be called the R word, it is just it's not respecting them as a person. People feel uncomfortable, and it's not very good for to say. to encourage people to see if we are respected enough for other people so we can treat others with respect. This is my friend Adam. Say hi Adam. Hi. Adam was born with one extra chromosome. That's the only thing that makes him different from you and me. About showing respect and that respect comes through our actions through our words and if people are just blatantly throwing our word out there it really does disrespect not only the person who might have a disability but all of those people around them. when he used the i word it makes people feel really bad for this though so and sometimes you have to think about that before you say it that was Valley News Team's Nicole Johnson reporting. If you want to pledge to end the R word, log on to valleynewslive.com and then click on this story.